Alliance ships move in. Save the Destiny Ascension. Commander, we're picking up reinforcements. It's the Alliance. Thank the Goddess. safe now. Where's the commander? Ambassador, Captain, Commander Shepard. We have gathered here to recognize the enormous contributions of the Alliance forces in the war against Sovereign and the Geth. Many humans lost their lives in the battle to save the Citadel. Brave and courageous soldiers who willingly gave their lives so that... 
we, the Council, might live. There is no greater sacrifice, and we share your grief over the tragic loss of so many noble men and women. The Council also owes you a great personal debt, Commander, one we can never repay. You saved not just our lives, but the lives of billions from Sovereign and the Reapers. Commander Shepard, your heroic and selfless actions serve as a symbol of everything humanity and the Alliance stand for. And though we cannot bring back those valiant soldiers who gave their lives to save ours, we can honor their memories through our actions. Humanity has shown it is ready to stand as a defender and protector of the galaxy. You have proved you are worthy to join our ranks and serve beside us on the Citadel Council. Counselor, on behalf of Humanity and the Alliance, we thank you for this prestigious honor and humbly accept. We will need a list of potential candidates to fill Humanity's seat on the Council. Given all that has happened, I am sure your recommendation will carry a great deal of weight, Commander. Do you support any particular candidate? I want a true advocate for humanity on the Council. Someone who'll protect the interests of our species no matter what. I want Udina. Well, the Ambassador has worked with the Council in the past, and we are familiar with his style and methods. A little too familiar, you could say. Oh, you haven't seen anything yet, Counselor. I've been holding back. I am certain we will all learn to work together in time. Sovereign's defeat marks the beginning of a new era for both humanity and the Council. Sovereign was only a vanguard. The Reaper fleet is still coming. Hundreds of ships, maybe thousands. And I'm gonna find some way to stop them. Shepard's right. Humanity is ready to do its part. United with the rest of the Council, we have the strength to overcome any challenge. When the Reapers come, we must stand side by side. We must fight against them as one. Together, we will drive them back into dark space. Engaging FTL drives. Emission sinks active. Board is green. We are running silent. We're wasting our time. Four days searching up and down this sector, and we haven't found any sign of Geth activity. Three ships went missing here in the past month. Something happened to them. My money's on slavers. The terminus system is crawling with them. Picking up something on the long range scanner. Unidentified vessel. Hmm, looks like a cruiser. Doesn't match any known signatures. Cruiser is changing course. Now on intercept trajectory. It can't be. Stealth systems are engaged. There's no way a Geth ship could possibly. It's not the Geth. Brace for evasive maneuvers!
for launch. Will the Alliance get here in time? The Alliance won't abandon us. We just need to hold on. Get everyone onto the escape shuttles. Joker's still in the cockpit. He won't abandon ship. I believe... Saved your life. Let me fly. And there's this. They only told me last night.
I guess we'll have to give her a name. Welcome aboard the New Normandy, Commander. I've been looking over the dossiers. I've seen a Solarian professor on Onika. We know the Collectors use some type of advanced technology. We'll need him to develop a countermeasure to protect us. You still don't get it, do you? You're not in charge of this mission. I am. Operative Lawson makes a valid point, Shepard. Without the Professor, any encounter with the Collectors would result in failure. Who are you? I am the Normandy's artificial intelligence. The crew like to refer to me as Edie. Helmsmen aren't happy when someone takes control of a ship away from them, especially Joker. I do not helm the ship. Mr. Moreau's talents will not go to waste. During combat, I operate the electronic warfare and cyber warfare suites. Beyond that, I cannot interface with the ship's systems. I observe and offer analysis and advice. Nothing more. I'm guessing it takes more than just the three of us plus Joker to fly this ship. The Normandy has a full crew. They're at their stations awaiting your orders. Final preparations for takeoff are complete, Commander. When you're ready to go, just pick a destination from the galaxy map and the CIC and I'll plot a course. Jacob and I should return to our posts. Come find us if you have any questions. Can you believe this, Commander? It's my baby! Better than new! It fits me like a glove! And leather seats! Military may set the hardware standard, but on a first-gen frigate, they could care less if the seats breathe. Civilian sector comfort by design. The reproduction is not intended to be perfect, Mr. Moreau. Seamless improvements were made. And there's the downside. I liked the Normandy when she was beautiful and quiet. Now she's got this thing I want to talk about. It's like ship cancer. And it's not the same, Joker. There's nothing here that was even part of the real Normandy. There's us. I have to take what I can get. The last two years sucked. You'll see. Even if an AI is spying on us, no way they'll invest this much just to screw us over. It'll be better than the old days. I hope so. I died.